Hi, I'm Rebecca Ryan. I'm a shamanic witch in Melbourne, Victoria. And in response to a question from one of the YouTube videos, I'd like to talk to you about why you would call an entity into one of your magical um, creations. So, a magical something might be a crystal ball, a wand, a broom, uh, a crystal. It could be all sorts of things. You obviously want to call in magical energies into a spell. The question from the YouTube video is why? Why would we do that? And so the answer is, well, first of all, thank you for the question. And if there are more questions, please feel free to let me know. The answer to the question of why would call an entity in is because it magically charges. So this is just a wand. Yeah, this is crystal put together with, I'm sure, great love and care. Not by me. But when I bought this, it is just this. To make this magically charged, I then invite a spirit in. So I invoke it, and, and you probably know how to do that already. Um, I want for my magical workings to connect with this world. So I want to have this world results from my magical workings. I use my imagination, I use all of my magical power, but the results need to be in this world. Connecting a spirit in helps to magically charge something, so it gives me greater imagination, it gives me greater magical power, and also it's the connector between my magical world, or my secondary process world, into the physical world. So calling a spirit or an entity into something, like this wand, makes it alive. And by alive I mean extra power, extra charge, and then extra connection into this world. That's why I do it. Highly recommend it. I don't have anything magical around me that isn't supported by a spirit, an entity, a something from other realms, just to help with everything that I'm doing. Thank you.